you know, in all my time in Nuka World, I didn't know the void was right there. Um... Seriously? Look away. Look at it. I guess I never particularly looked at that one particular hedge. Well, it's... I didn't intend on making a video here, but... I guess I might as well now, since there's a glitch, a little glitchy area there. Can I stand on it? I'm worried about falling in the void, though. Fortunately, in this game, it's not like in Minecraft, where you fall in the void and you disappear and lose all your stuff. That's weird. It doesn't do it here. Oh, it does do it here. If you look straight down at the hedges, you see the ground disappear. Not in this particular spot. I'm hitting my head on that bar. There's going to be a lot of over-encumbering in this, but I'm not going to make the entire video. I'm not going to make it like a 30-minute video. Let's say about the last 10-minute thing on final thoughts on Nuka World. The location is okay. But it seems kind of lacking to me. Like, just doing the good side right there locks me out of 90% of the trophies. For it. Also locks out a large portion of the game. There's no more side quests or things like that for the good side. There's a bunch of side quests for the jerks, which is mostly being a jerk, and ruining your commonwealth. And there's raiding settlements, which is a dumb idea to begin with. So, here's what they wanted you to do. You put all that time and effort and energy into building settlements, defending them. You keep running into a few problems, so you tweak the defenses, make it a little better. Maybe build a wall around it, and then find their spawn points, and then build the defenses there. And then, what do they want you to do? Oh, just the hell with your settlements. No one, no one cares anymore. Just wipe them out. Apparently everyone likes me. I, I honestly feel like there's n virtually no good guy side in this. Holy shit, boss. That was some reckoning you pulled off. Never thought I'd say it. But I sure am glad you ended up at Nuka World. That year we spent under those raiders won't be easy to forget. But I never even You spent an entire under year under the raiders. We owe you hmm. so much. I don't even know where to begin. Besides saying thanks. Don't worry, Harvey. You're welcome. Maybe now we can restore this place back to its former glory. A fair trading post with good people. And once word spreads about what you did here, no way any raiders are going to think about touching this place anytime soon. Ooh, I wiped them out. And believe me, if they show up again, I will be ready to wipe them out again. Uh, it's going to be night soon, which is going to be a problem since my helmet's gone. Have you noticed how... Oh, I have a level up. I think I want gunslinger. Slinger. 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 Uh, I was considering maxing out Gunslinger to max out my revolver beforehand. I probably would have preferred using it more often than my than just using the shotgun so much. If I did. Yeah. 
Used to work because the Raiders made me. Now it's because I really want to make this place better. I wonder if talking to her eliminated any stragglers that were left behind, like somewhere back here or in the corner. Like all the rest just despawned. I'm pretty sure I wiped most of them out, though. You really gave those raiders hell, boss. Pretty sure I wiped them out. And I will not ask them because you are annoying. Pack Butcher. Still don't have any lights. I'm probably going to just park the power armor by the power armor stand. In which case, I'm actually going to go do that now. Then I'm going to loot everything that I can. Hopefully it didn't have too many despawn on me. Because I'm pretty sure that I'm not going to get any more of these armor pieces after this. I kind of wish they would replace the uh, raiders in the commonwealth with raiders like this. So they would be a little more interesting. A little less useless. As it is, I don't even want to deal with the raiders. I just want to keep going and let my companion wipe them out. Because if I turn around and shoot them, they'll die in one shot. Hey, come here. It didn't wipe them out. I need to get it daytime. Or get out of this power armor so I could use a pit boy light. So I'm gonna park right around this corner here by that power thing and take the fusion core out. It's only a frame right now, anyway. All the pieces are stuck in my inventory because they're broken. I want the light bulbs. I don't care about the glass, but the copper is useful. Now if I exit right here... I didn't mean to enter. Blast. I'm so used to clicking X on a container and taking the items from them. Remind me not to mess with you when you're in that thing. Hey, I have my helmet on this time. And my cappy glasses. See, you can't tell the hairstyle I'm using with that. I think I'll stick with the cappy glasses. My carry weight in is in a frame. 410 pounds. Using Grilled Radstag, as you can see. Ah, the captain's feast is still on. I need to go... I need to find a way to get... XP. I think I got a pretty good amount of XP from that. I should have found the dupe glitch for the last day captain's feast and did that. Oh well. Forty fire carry weight food. Rolled rad stag. So Once I get out, my carry weight's going to go up. Four hundred and ninety. The reason is because it doesn't account for the armor. Now it's just a frame. As you can see from my AP dropping like a stone. Wait. Oh, never mind. Oh. I wiped everyone out here.
I'd say for about a few minutes I had felt bad about blasting Gage into nothing. Then I remembered he's a raider. And apparently his arm's clipping through his body. What happened here? Damn. Ah, uh, you are a potential companion, but you went the way of the Institute guy. And now you're dead. Get off my lawn. Uh, no. Go over the fence. Drop. Enjoy floating on. So, McCready, how's things going? Look alive. Nah, I better not talk. There's a glitch with the companions. If you choose to select friend, it well, it might not be a glitch. It might just be giving you the option again and again. But as long as I say friend, he keeps bringing it up because I didn't say romance. Sorry, McCready, I just don't swing that way. There's no enemies over here. Oh, my final thoughts. My final thing is Fallout seems like a pretty good game. This whole thing with the raiders and trying to make you a raider kind of... I feel like they left out the good side. As much as everyone kept saying they leave left out the ability to be a jerk and the rest of it, they completely ignored the possibility of a good side on this. Which I think really just leaves out the other other side of the player's list. So you're, you have to be a good guy through the whole commonwealth and you have to be a bad and you have to be a bad guy here. Unless you want to do this little side quest that pretty much locks out all the main quests. Well, that'll be it for this one. Tune in next time when I decide to do a unique build time. Hopefully it's unique. It's an idea I just came out came up with. See you later. Have a good day. Bye bye.